Hello and welcome to HD Calcs. I'm Rick and in this video we're going to have a look at how we can replace the batteries on the TI-84 Texas Instruments graphing calculator. If you don't have one of these calculators but would like one, check the link in the description below. So I just grabbed my calculator out of the drawer where it's been sitting for about a year and tried to turn it on. When I did that, nothing happens. Looks like I'm out of batteries. To replace my batteries, what I need is four AAA batteries for the main power supply. And this calculator also uses a 357 or a 303 round battery as the backup battery. Both of these batteries should be easy to find. I got both the AAA and round batteries at my local Walmart. Typically, it's a good idea to replace both at the same time, though if you're in a pinch, the AAAs usually run out first, so you can just replace those if you need to. To do this, we'll want a small Phillips head screwdriver, like something out of a eyeglass repair or electronics repair kit, something like this. Once we have our batteries and screwdriver together, we get started by taking our calculator and turning it over so that we see this on the back here. We can open our battery compartment by pulling down and lifting this back plate up. There we go, there's our batteries. We'll start by replacing our triple A's. So to do that, we just take these out and safely dispose of them. Then we take our new batteries and insert them according to the positive negative diagram on the calculator. So negative to the spring, positive into the flat spot and alternate that as we go. Once we've got our triple A's placed, we can grab our screwdriver and open up the backup battery panel here. Should open pretty easily. And there we can see our battery. We can pop it out and set it aside and take our new one and go ahead and replace that where your old battery was. There we go. Now we've got all our batteries put back. We'll take our back panel and replace it. With the screwdriver. and then put the final panel back on. There we go, we've replaced these batteries. Now if we turn it over and press the on button, this screen will pop up. It says RAM cleared and press alpha one to alpha four to locate the shortcut menu. Well, let's just hit the F1 and that takes us to our y equals screen and if we hit second quit it goes back to our blank main screen and we can go ahead and use this calculator again thanks for watching everybody i really hope this has been helpful if it has you can help me out by hitting that like button and subscribe for more calculator tips in the future and as always Good luck on those tests out there, everybody. You've got this.